Hey, what's up, buddies? Welcome back. My name is Beaker. Today is a big day, buddies. We're going to stream on Camcord. We're also going to do a video right now, but we're streaming on Camcord every Thursday and Saturday. Don't forget, buddies. We got a link in the description below that'll take you right to it. So if you guys haven't checked it out yet, check it out. Anyway, today we got some just crazy, random, crazy raids from the clan chat of my clan. I sometimes go down and I'm just like, what? Like, the, my clan mates, they just tend to share the craziest raids. So we're going to check out three of the. Well, top three of the day. Let's check them out. So this was Diesel. This was actually a while ago, but I recorded this just like, what? Look at this Dark Elixir. So, yeah, if you didn't see it at the start, it was like, what? <laughs> 7,500 Dark Elixir? Like, what? I, I don't think I've ever seen this. I don't think I've ever gotten this much anyway. But, you know, good job for Diesel. The thing is, though, his army is like a lot of Dark Elixir. <laughs> So it kind of cancels it out, right? Anyway, let's let's keep watching. He's in the middle here, and this is a good base. The, the only bad thing about this guy's base, for him, is that he has one expo upgrading. Other than that, I mean, he's got pretty good defenses. He's got max Teslas, max expos. They're gunning him down here, but he's still in the middle. He's still doing good. He's still killing. He's got a ton of witches. So this guy must have been off for a while. Yeah. Look at those. Oh, dude, look at those gold mines up at the top. They're full. Right? The, the ones on the left and the drills are definitely full. Dark drills fill up pretty quickly. That's for sure. Like, everything else takes days to fill up. But the dark drills, no. No, they take like one day to fill up. So, yeah, there it is. Boom. Now he's only got one dark drill left. But <laughs> still, look at the loot that's left. It's like a full normal raid. <laughs> and he, he's already gotten like uh, like a million loot almost. So let's see as he gets up to the top here. Is he going to be able to get the three star? I would guess maybe. <laughs> what do you guys think? Is he going to get a Titan League or a Legend League three star right now? Maybe. Yeah. There's only like three defenses left. So unless something really catastrophic happens here, he's definitely going to get it. Dude, I think it's all about the Warden, man. I think the Warden made this possible. Because with the Witches and the Warden, they're just so strong. All this, They're like, they won't die. So there it is. Wrapping up an insane Legend League 3 czar from Diesel. Wow. I would like to congratulate Diesel, by the way, for getting the Legend League. That's just nuts. It's, it's crazy. A lot of people do it nowadays, but it's still... Always gonna be crazy. For any of you guys out there that are trying to get to Legend League or have already gotten above 5,000 trophies, props to you. Beaker will not really be doing that anytime soon. All right, buddies, what do we got next? Oh, we got the Dark Dragon. What's up, dude? Hey, check that out. <laughs> this guy's trying to just drop wall breakers and they're dying. There's like the fifth one. Finally gets in. Boom. Cool. Had to use a giant, though. Yeah, that's kind of a good idea to bring some giants with this army. You guys see that? He's using golems, pekkas, and giants. I like that. Maybe I'll try that. It's still going to be a lot of elixir. That's the thing about pekkas, dude. Pekkas are so expensive. One of my clanmates did a... What was it? A six pekka attack the other day in war. It worked really, really well. I'm going to show you guys that soon, I think. So, the idea here is... I think... Yeah, I don't know what this guy's doing. I honestly can't even tell you. I think he's trying to go in here in the bottom to take out the eagle artillery. He's like, oh, check this out. I can get this. Wait, maybe not. Dude, <laughs> all of his Teslas are right here and his clan castle too. They're Watch how fast they crush this guy. Oh, what? <laughs> wow. Wow, the clan castle's still just sitting there. So, moral of the story is, if you don't bring a poison spell, you're going to get crushed. Right? I mean, that's what I always think. I'm, I always bring a poison spell. So, yeah, it gets worse. It gets deeper. The story continues. The clan castle just crushed that golem. The golem is dead already. It just barely got into the base and it's dead. So, yeah, that's a thing. Now up top, they're going in with some giants and the heroes. This guy does not have max heroes. He has pretty good ones, but not maxed. I don't know if your level 30 heroes are going to get all the way in there, man. Wow. Look at all the expos shooting at once. It looks so cool. Like, they, they're all locked onto the king. Now they're on the barbs. Now they're kind of on that golem. <laughs> it looks pretty crazy, right? I, I think it's nuts that there's four expos now. It kind of just, like, it's crazy to me. Like, four expos? That's a lot. That's a lot of damage. And it can go real. <laughs> Look at that. All four of the expos are shooting at once. Wow. I'm going to save that that little clip forever. That was, that was highly enjoyable. I, <laughs> I really like that. This is why you guys are always like, Beak, you laugh too much. 32 trophy. <laughs> wow, dude. He got 30%. And he lost 32 trophies. I mean, 
Wow. In this case, I really think the guy just paid because he tried to do that weird thing at the bottom and then he paid because he didn't have a poison spell. I would say that was the real problem there. Anyway, the next one is the weirdest one of the whole day because, okay, yeah, I get it. This, this used to be a really fun, effective strategy, but nowadays, if you use like 10 or 12 healers, it's really not that much better than if you use six healers or five healers. I mean, it's, it's really not that much different. So this guy has 12 healers right now. <laughs> Did I explain that fully? Anyway, let's watch what happens. We were talking about this in chat, and I think the only benefit to this is if an air defense starts shooting your healers, you've got, like, healers for days, you know? I think that's the one benefit. But, like, look at this. Like, the, the health of the queen is still going down. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, like, class changed, I'm sure all you guys know, but class changed healers. They made healers less effective in large groups now. So if you have 12 healers, it's pretty much the same as six. <laughs> yeah. Maybe this guy doesn't know, or maybe he just doesn't care. Maybe he's just wants to ball out with the healers. Yeah. Anyway, uh, this guy does not have clan castle. I wonder if, <laughs> I wonder if when this guy does have clan castle troops, he uses two more healers. That would be, that would be classy. <laughs> 14 healers. <laughs> anyway, back to the show. So the queen is in there. She's level 26. She can hold her own, but dude, she would be dying right now if it wasn't for that rage spell. So even though he has 12 healers, it, it she can still die. See, you would think he would bring... You guys know how like I do the queen walk thing with a ton of giants and archers and barbs? You would think he would do that because it's probably going to be a similar cost. Healers are expensive. So sub in some other troops. Sub in some giants. Sub in some barbs and archers. Yeah, that's just what Beaker thinks. I mean, Beaker doesn't really makes sense all the time, but I think that makes sense. I mean, am I right? Anyway, trainee, <laughs> you do you, buddy. Don't let Beaker sway you. So the the only big, big problem I see with this army is time. And look, he's he's been going for so long. I had to do double time because I couldn't stand watching it anymore at, at one time speed. It's like he almost isn't even going to make it to the Dark Elixir. Finally, there's 30 seconds left in the raid and he finally steps up, gets shot by the Tesla, almost dies. Now he is dying. This is the best part, I think. Look, she's gonna die. <laughs> wow. He was able to kill a queen that had 12 healers on her or something. It was it was at least 10. I think a couple of them died, but that was like 10 healers and she still died. So that kind of shows you what I was saying. Six healers, 10 healers. It's pretty much all the same. I would say five or six is probably the most you should use. Unless you just want to really ball out with it and have fun. Uh, you know, it, it's it's fine. I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to hate. I'm not going to hate. Anyway, trainee, good job, I guess. Um, you got some Dark Elixir for show. Anyway, that's going to be it for today, guys. That is all we have. We got to stream in a little bit, so I'm going to get ready for that. Probably put a white tee on, and, you know. Freshen up. <laughs> anyway, you guys see I have a black tee on today? Like, that's a first, right? I've, like, never worn a black tee. Maybe back in the day, but not lately. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And, uh, hey, check it out. It's Beaker08. <laughs> What's up, dude? I never play on this account, but maybe I'll start soon. Anyway, that's it for today, guys. Hope to see you next time and at the stream later today. Peace. Peace.